Most recently, we had this new phenomenon we're calling colony collapse disorder, which is really hurting a few operations very badly. And so in these operations, they're losing 30 to 70 percent of their colonies, and that's unsustainable. Um, we're not worried that we're going to lose all the honeybees. We're worried we're going to lose those commercial beekeepers that truck their bees across the country in order to, to produce the fruits and vegetables we enjoy. Right now, we're losing unsustainable levels of colonies every year. For the last three years, we've lost more bees than beekeepers can afford to replace. And so we're really worried that these commercial beekeepers are going to go out of business. And that's a, that's a real concern, not just for them, but for all the farmers relying on them for pollination. Never before have we seen losses so expansive across the country. And in fact, we've seen high losses not only in the United States, but in Canada, in Europe, and in Japan. Not all of it is colony collapse disorder, but certainly honeybee populations seem to be in decline in a lot of industrialized countries. We're having losses in the 70-80% range year after year, and it's just, it's, it's kind of devastating. If the bees all go away and the beekeepers all go away, you know, we're going to change our eating habits drastically because you're not going to be eating these apples. I mean, there'd be some apples, but not very many of them. And, uh, you know, there wouldn't be very many blueberries. I mean, you know, the blueberry people tell us they don't have bees to make blueberries. They don't have the blueberry business. And the almond people will tell you the same thing. And so we'd probably be eating potatoes and corn, you know. Anyone who cares about eating all natural food really should worry about the honeybees. At Hagen Dazs, we've been making ice cream for almost 50 years, and we've always used nothing but all natural ingredients, many of which require honeybees to get pollinated. In fact, over half of the flavors in the Hagen Dazs ice cream line require ingredients that are pollinated by honeybees. Ingredients like strawberries and strawberry ice cream, raspberries for raspberry sorbet, peanuts for chocolate peanut butter. So when we heard that honeybees were in trouble, we had to get involved.